John Falstaff Knight. Every man must know that. As oft as he hath occasion to name himself. Even like those that are kin to the king. For they never prick their finger, but they say, there's some of the king's blood spilt. <laughs> How comes that, says he, that takes upon him not to conceive? The answer is as ready as a borrowed cap. I am the king's poor cousin, sir. <laughs> Nay, they will be kin to us, or they will but fetch it from Japheth. <laughs> but to the letter. Sir John Falstaff Knight. <coughs> To the son of the king, nearest his father, Harry, Prince of Wales, greeting. Why, this is a certificate. Please. <laughs> I will imitate the Honourable Romans in brevity. Sure he means brevity of breath, short-winded. I commend me to thee, I commend thee, and I leave thee. Be not too familiar with points. <laughs> For he misuses thy favours so much that he swears thou art to marry his sister Nell. <laughs> Repent at idle times as thou mayest, and so farewell. Thine by yea and no, which is as much to say as thou usest him. Jack Falkstaff with my familiars, John with my brothers and sisters, and Sir John with all Europe. My lord, I'll steep this letter in sack and make him eat it. As to making me twenty of his words. But do you use me thus, Ned? Must I marry your sister? God send the wench no worse of fortune. But I never said so. Well, thus we play the fools with the time, and the spirits of the wise sit in the clouds and mock us. Is your master here in London? Yes, my lord. Where sups he? Did the old boar feed in the old frank? The old frank, my lord, he's fit. What company? Ephesians, my lord, of the old church. Sup any women with him? None, my lord, but old Mistress Quickly and Mistress Doll Tearsheet. <laughs> what pagan may that be? A proper gentlewoman, sir, and a kinswoman of my master's. Are even such kin as the parish heifers out of the town bull? <laughs> <laughs> she would steal upon them, Ned, at supper. I am your shadow, my lord. I'll follow you. Sir, you boy. And part off. No word to your master that I am yet in town. Here's for your silence. <laughs> I have no tongue, my lord. <laughs> if I mind, sir, I will govern it. Very well, go. This dull tear sheet should be some road. I warrant you as common as the way between St. Albans and London. How may we see Falstaff bestow himself tonight in his true colours and not ourselves be seen? Put on two leaven jerkins and aprons and wait upon him at his table like drawers. From a god to a bull, a heavy declension, it was Jove's case. From a prince to apprentice, a low transformation, that shall be mine. For in everything, the purpose must weigh with folly. Follow me, Ned. Stand here by me, Master Robert Shallow. Mm. Ah. I will make the king do you grace. I will leer upon him as he comes by, and do but mark the countenance he will give me. God bless thy lung, good night. Come, Pistol. <laughs> Stand behind me. Oh, if I had had time to have made new liveries, I would have bestowed the thousand pounds I borrowed of thee. Ah! Uh, but uh, tis no matter. Uh, this poor show doth better. This doth infer the zeal I had to see him. It doth so. It shows my earnestness in affection. It doth so. My devotion. It doth, it doth, it doth. As it were to ride day and night, not to deliberate, not to remember, not to have patience to shift me. It is most certain. But to stand stained with travel, sweating with desire, thinking of nothing else, putting all affairs in oblivion, 
as if there was nothing else to be done but to see him. Tis Semperi Dame, for Omsqui Hoc Nihil Est is all in every part. Tis so indeed. My knight, I will inflame thy noble liver and make thee rage. Thy doll, and Helen of thy noble thoughts, is in base durance and contagious prison. Oh! Hold thither by most mechanical and dirty hands. Oh! Rouse up revenge from Ebon Dane with Felelecto's snake, for doll is in. Oh! Pistol speaks uh, naught but truth. I will deliver her. <laughs> there roared the sea, and trumpet clangor sound. God save thy grace. King Hal, by royal Hal. The heavens be God and keep most royal imp of theme. God save thee, my sweet boy. My Lord Chief Justice, speak to that vain man. Have you your wits? Know you what tis you speak? My king, my Jove, I speak to thee, my heart. I know thee not, old man. Fall to thy prayers. How ill white hairs become a fool and jester. I have long dreamed of such a kind of man, so surfeit swelled, so old and so profane. But being awaked, I do despise my dream. Make less thy body hence, and more thy grace. Leave gormandizing. Know the grave doth gape for thee thrice wider than for other men. But Reply not to me with a full-born jest. Presume not that I am the thing I was. For God doth know, so shall the world perceive that I have turned away my former self. So shall I those that kept me company. And thou dost hear, I am as I have been, approach me, and thou shalt be as thou wast, the tutor and the feeder of my riots. Till then I banish thee on pain of death, as I have done the rest of my misleaders, not to come near our person by ten miles. For competence of life I will allow you, but lack of means enforce you not to evil. And as we hear you do reform yourselves, we shall, according to your strength and qualities, give you advancement. Be it your charge, my lord, to see perform the tenor of our word. Set on. Master Shallow, I owe you a thousand pounds. I marry Sir John, which I beseech you to let me have home with me. That can hardly be, Master Shallow. Oh! Do not you agree with this? <laughs> I shall be sent for in private to him. Look you, he must seem thus to the world. Fear not your advancement. I shall be the man yet who shall make you great. I cannot well perceive how, unless you should give me your doublet and stuff me out with straw. <laughs> I beseech you, good Sir John. Let me have five hundred of my thousand. Sir, I will be as good as my word. This that you heard was but a colour. Colour, I fear that you will die in, Sir John. Fear no colours. Go with me to dinner. Come, Lieutenant Pistol. Come, Bardolph. I shall be sent for soon. At night. <laughs> Go carry Sir John Fullstaff to the fleet, and take all his company along with him. The Lord! The Lord! I cannot now speak. I will hear you soon. Take them away. <laughs> <laughs> 